channel. Usually I would say, hello, my name is Josephine and these are my creatures, but this is not made by me. It's made by Barbara, aka Miss Cerise Dolls on Instagram. We took a part in a swap that was hosted by Red Row Dolls and the theme was Greatest Showman. So it was like circus, carnival, something like that. And the funny thing is that Barbara was also my partner, so I made her a doll and she made me a doll. And I think that is just kind of like faith, if you ask me. Um, I love her style. She has a very unique own style of doing repaints and dolls. I'm just so excited! Woo! I can't wait to open it. Um, yeah, I, I gave her like three options to choose from what kind of doll she wanted to make for me. I requested a bearded lady character because I would love to do a beard on a doll. That would be so fun. And then the second one was a gender bent ringmaster, so like a lady ringmaster with the top hat and the red coat, or a gypsy vibe uh, fortune teller. So we will see just a minute from now which one she picked from me. And yeah, I'm gonna scoot you guys a little bit closer so you can see all the details. Hopefully this part doesn't, <laughs> doesn't get oh, too long. I should have probably pre-opened some of it, but at least you know it's authentic, not a fake reaction or anything. So I skipped a little bit ahead because this tape was just killing me, it was not coming off. I do hope I'm opening it the right way. Stationery, so cool. It's like a little card. Um, certificate of authenticity. Oh, yay! She picked. Uh, there's a name for the doll here, and it says the future teller. So I think she's like the gypsy vibe fortune teller that I was asking for. Uh, British Showman Swap Red Row Dolls 2019. Uh, this doll is a one of a kind be piece created with love by Barbara Miss Theresa Dolls. And Barbara lives in Rome, Italy, so this package came all the way from there to here. So, um, and then there's still, like this lovely postcard with all of her repaints. Oh, there's one of my favorite ones. This one, the girl with the bangs and shorter hair. <gasps> that was so pretty. Yay! Which package we should pick? Let's pick some of these smaller ones. This looks very cute. Oh, is this a little ball? Like the, like the glass ball for the doll? I think it is. It's so cool. I was like secretly hoping for it because that would have been the one I would have picked from the three three options. Was the fortune teller or the bearded lady? I'm like in between. Look, it's like her teeny tiny crystal ball. She has really 
like attention to detail, like to find something like that and put the effort into finding it. That is so sweet. There's a knot. Knot in there. What are these? These are pieces of bark. she knew but I'm actually a florist so every time I get like weird plant stuff I'm like yes what is this from oh look at this it's like a seed some sort of seed pocket oh, this will make like, like a really nice fantasy creature like a hat this could be a someone's hat Definitely make something special out of those. I think the dog one is the pink one, so I'll leave that to the last. I think I think this is some sort of stand. Right. I've never seen an Ever After High Doll in real life because they are not sold here in Finland. Um, Monster High is obviously discontinued, but um, I've never seen one in real life. And I think this is an Ever After High Doll stand. So it's really like pretty. Get that. Those out of the way. There's like her like little card and a little trinket, a little fairy, I love it. And I love this fuchsia color, so pretty. Extra not. This is like her card, and this is this card. These are her contacts. Sorry, my, my face was itching, so I had to scratch it. <laughs> the most amazing like body blush 
washing. I love it. It's so weird to see an MRF to hide all in real life. They have such a different face than Monster High ones. And her little feet. Oh my god. And she has a dress, a little skirt with like layers of stuff. And a little like scarf. Thank you so much, Barbara. I love her. Just look. And these are like ombre. And the hair is like ombre from from this really, really pretty like I don't know periwinkle blue. To a lilac color. Just wham! There's her like crystal ball. She can predict your future. I'm <laughs> just gonna take you guys a little bit closer to her so you get to see all of the pretty details. Look at that top. I think she's hand painted that one. And look at this face. and also follow Barbara at Miss Series Dolls and like this video and leave a comment about her. What do you think about her? Do you like her? <laughs> yeah, until next time. Bye guys.